Police are using all sorts of GPS based products to find vehicles before they're sold or trashed, but there is a warning before consumers use the technology. GPS tracking your car's every move with capabilities like locating, slowing down, or even stopping a stolen car after a carjacking. They pinpoint the location of the vehicle for us. One of the most well-known systems is OnStar in GM vehicles and can be added to others. But we're definitely using that and we're recovering the cars very quickly. It gives us an edge. What would be the warning to people though who are using this technology? One of the biggest warnings uh, is to call 911, call law enforcement. We are not looking for um, you to track your own vehicle. If your vehicle does not come with GPS, many times you can add it. You can help police recover a stolen vehicle. Systems like Pastime can also help you locate your vehicle. Pandora uses a small tag for the car owner to hold on to, keeping it separate from their keys. A motion sensor must be near the car to drive it. If not, the vehicle will slow down and stop after 30 seconds. And Chicago police tell the I team that cameras, which read license plates, will be installed soon on Lakeshore Drive. What we have seen is many carjacking offenders are using this, um, you know, because it's basically an expressway to get from one side of the city to the other side. However, all of this technology won't replace old school precautions. Starting that vehicle up very early in the morning, going back inside for that coffee, uh, and then coming back 10 minutes later and your, your vehicle is gone. Police also say you should be getting in and out of your car quickly, keep your doors locked, be alert at intersections and gas stations, and stay close to your phone. Jason Knowles, ABC7 Eyewitness News. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.